Alright, we're covering the uh, final chapter in Portal 2, which is chapter 9. Um, technically there's chapter 10 too, but that that's just the end movie. Um, so I guess we'll be covering both of them in one go. And there's uh, one final achievement to get um, in single player. To know what your big surprise is. Well, only two more chambers. Uh, chamber 17. Alright. Oh. Surprise! We're doing it now. Ha. Ha. You probably figured it out by now, but I don't need you anymore. I found two little robots back here built specifically for testing. What? Uh oh. <laughs> Looks like we're expendable now. Yeah, fair, fair. Alright. Hello! This is the part where I kill you. Alright, we're gonna fire a portal up at that white spot real quick. And I thought to myself, yeah, it's deadly. What's missing? What's missing? No, 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 no. Alright, and then an orange portal right there where that stuff's dropping. And then jump on through. Oh! And we just avoid getting crushed. And we're gonna save the game right here. Because this is an achievement we can get, but it requires us dying. Oh? Oh? Oh, you came back, did it? Oh, what's the plan for this? Oh, wow, good. Oh! And we got pit boss for doing that. <laughs> His reaction's pretty amusing. Okay, we're gonna reload from where we just saved. And um, that's the only achievement you gotta go out of the way for. No, seriously, do come back, please. Come back, please. Nope, you can screw off this time. <laughs> Look, I've decided I'm not gonna kill you, okay, if you come back. Oh, just thinking back to the old All time. Alright, time to run. We were friends. Good old friends. Not just enemies. continue down this come thing. Back. You know, yeah, no problem. You come back. What happened to those days? Aww. Alright. Alright, you can see there's some white space down there. Alright, got a blue portal up at that white space above us. And jump on through. Can't help but notice Ooh. that you're not coming back. Which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea! Yes, oh. Yes, in your face, I've got an Alright, so blue portal above the ledge over on the other side where it's not destroyed, and an orange portal right here, and we just jump on through. And you want to be careful not to over jump that. Alright, we're loading next uh, section here. Alright. Don't. Don't run. You can't beat this thing. We just gotta wait for a second while this thing falls apart a bit. Oh. And as you can kind of see, uh, it looks like daylight is breaking through, which means that uh, this facility is really coming apart now. All right. Uh oh. Psych. <laughs> are they killing you? They are killing you, aren't they? <laughs> Deformed robots. Silently killing you, probably. Ha! Was oh. like a bullet, riddled bullet, fly out the roof. It was. Oh, oh run. The crap turrets, they? All right. Well. Yeah, that ledge starts to fall, so I definitely want to get off of it. I guess what? They're all full houses. They're Psh, cards, meaning whatever. Anyway, new time, <laughs> Ace of Doesn't make any sense. Alright, so blue portal where the, uh, um, excursion beam, uh, hits the wall. And we're just gonna pop orange portals behind the turrets until we push them all over. And then we're gonna fire, uh, 
something so that we can fly across here. I gotta watch out. Uh oh, psych. I just gotta get out of the excursion beam, just get down. Yeah, that's psych. Anyways, uh, blue portal at the excursion beam hit point. And an orange portal right there, and that sends us on to Holmes versus Moriarty, Aristotle versus Matthew's fight place. All right, Stay still, please. an orange portal right there, right, stop and you should be all right. This thing what? isn't going to be able to hit us. You just got to make sure that you um, do that crap and then get out of the way before this thing smashes you. Where do you go? Where do you go? Come back, come back. No. Eat me. Bam. Alright. Something break back there. So we're gonna hit this oh, and jump. Oh, did it kill you? That would be amazing if it killed and you. And we're good. That's it. <laughs> Hello? We're gonna need to put oh, a portal oh, oh, there. Yes, oh, alright, no, just had a brainwave. I'll be back. If you're still alive, I'm gonna be back. Don't die until I get back. Alright. And we're gonna fire our orange portal on the ceiling, uh, through that broken glass there. And that allows us to get inside here. And um, I'm gonna drop a blue portal um, right there, and it's gonna have uh, the repulsor gel come through. And then we're gonna start firing orange portals on this wall over here to start hitting these turrets. And you just keep moving it around. And as long as we're standing on this button, this stuff will keep coming out, so. Work on your aim. There we go, we got all of them. And uh, I'm gonna fire some repulsor gel right there. And um, we have our portal now up at that little white space. Ooh. Oh. Looks like uh, <laughs> we didn't really need that repulsor gel up there, but. Alright, hold B. And then that way we don't bounce. And then now we can use the faith plate. And now we've launched ourselves back to where we were before. We can continue on unimpugned. Head through this next corridor. See, there's like a little mark on the ground right there. <clears throat> and our next portal is going to be right here on the wall. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit this button, and then this tube is gonna bend down, and there's little explosive balls going through it, and they're gonna fire through our portal, and they should, yep, come out and then hit the um, conversion gel. That did exactly what we needed it to do. And the reason we do that is so that we can fire orange portal at the floor and then, oops, oh, up, oh, okay. There we go, and get on through the other side. And we can go through this doorway here and uh, continue on our path. All right, I'm gonna go down here. And next we're gonna be on this conveyor belt thing. As we start to, uh... Oh, we wait for this stuff to smash on pass here. Oh, and that gate opens up so this thing can try to stab us, but you just wait until you get to this part and then walk over. Alright, so notice how bombs will fall out of this thing again. We're going to fire a blue portal right where the bombs drop, and then we're going to fire our orange portal right underneath the uh, speed gel. And then the bomb comes through, and then you see the speed gel now is going to come in a constant stream through our portal. 
and uh, oops, messed up my portals. Orange portal there, and you want a blue portal right next to that to zero 09. And just wait for it to uh, coat the entire um, uh, strip of. Uh, the entire strip of land there. Okay, and just run through the portal you made and you'll come out the other side where your uh, speed gel was coming in through. I can really see things falling apart. And we can see daylight still. Just, everything's collapsing. Wheatley's really screwing things up royally. Alright, so, um... Yes, gel should still be going into the orange portal, so we're gonna fire our blue portal here. And that's gonna coat this entire strip here. I'm gonna fire our orange portal there. And we're gonna run through our blue portal, and it'll launch us straight into the excursion beam. Now we just get to watch things kind of fall apart around us as we're traveling through the air here. Damn. Gladys is starting to have a personality switch going on. Alright. Blue portal, right next to the wall here. And then fire through the grate, and we'll get an orange portal up there. And now we're gonna wait for a little loading screen. Do 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 do. This game is definitely getting, uh, Staying true to the Portal 1, plus, uh, definitely feel like it's adding a lot to this game. Anyways, um, okay, so, look up here, you'll see this white space, fire your orange portal here, and just fall through. So Gladys has now figured out uh, how we're going to get rid of Wheatley here. Ah, familiar location. <laughs> yes, I do. Hello. According to the control panel light up there, the entire building is going to self-destruct in about six minutes. I'm pretty sure it's, it's time for the final fight. The building, but just in case it isn't, I am actually going to have to kill you, um, as discussed earlier. So let's call that three minutes and then a minute break, but we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, huh. that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four-part plan is this. One, no portal services. Two, yep, he's right. But we have conversion gel. Alright, get behind the conversion gel tube immediately. Alright. Alright. Bad mistake, buddy. Alright, so blue portal on one of these uh, panels here, and then stand on some white space and wait for him to start throwing bombs, and then look for the explosion mark, and that allows you to uh, direct the bomb through your portal and onto him. Then you want to jump up here, keeping our blue portal there, and we're going to grab this first core, and once we do all this repulsor gel is going to fall down. And we use the repulsor gel to jump up and attach it to him. Core corruption at 50%. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. 
Reactor explosion in four minutes. Uh, what, what All right. What happened? What, 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 what so now we're gonna put a portal beneath him. Ah, uh, the bloody bombs are stuck on. Doesn't matter. I reconfigured the shield. All right, so his shield is going to protect him from above, so we're going to wait for his next set of bombs to come out. There we go. Wait for the explosion mark, and send them underneath him. And then fire a blue portal up there. All right. Use your pulsar gel to jump up. Oh, almost got it. Ah, all right. That's not working. Alright, we need to portal our way back up there. Be quick about this. Oh. Oh. There we go. Got him. Alright, gotta run to the other side of Wheatley now. Get on that blue pad, or blue blot there, and then jump up. And then we put the core in. Reactor explosion uncertainty, emergency preemption. Alright, so we're gonna stand over here, this keep our blue portal up, and we're gonna make him shoot on the white space here. Because this time he's gonna have the shield in front of him. There we go. Alright, hit him from behind. Alright, um. Got a little freezing here. Hopefully everything, uh. Okay. Sorry about orbit. that. Alright. Um, orange portal underneath uh, the next core. And our blue portal is going to go right here. And we're going to use the speed gel to run up into the air and grab it. We got him. And then blue gel and then jump and we reached him. And we're good. That's it. Oh, I see. Substitute well, almost. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? I'm gonna kind of let these guys talk it out before I just go ahead and. Did you pick up on my sarcasm? Stalemate detected. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution annex. Extinguishing. Huh? Oh, that just cleans right off, does it? Good to know. A little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate. Please press the stalemate resolution button. Alright, we're putting a portal underneath them on the one piece of uh, white area left. Huh? We're gonna have to portal our way into there. Uh oh. Are you still alive? Oh. You are joking. You have got to be kidding me. What? Well, I'm still in Yes, I am, son. And I have no idea how to fix this place. Oh, you had to play bloody cat bags, didn't you? While people were trying to work. Yeah, well, now we're all going to pay the price. Because we're all going to bloody. Die. Remember what uh, oh. Cave Johnson said about Lunar Dust? This is insane. <laughs> Prepare for a complete ridiculousness. <laughs> Damn straight. Let go. Let go. I'm still connected. I can pull myself in. I can still fix this. I already fixed it. And you are not coming back. Oh no. Change your plans. Hold on to me. Tighter. <laughs> Pulled back in by Gladys. Oh. <laughs> That's it. You're completing the game. I'm just gonna run let the end credits roll. Oh, thank God, you're all right. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy, but all along you were my best friend. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. 
Goodbye, Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, or fed me to birds. I had a pretty good life. And then you showed up, you dangerous mute lunatic. So you know what? You win. Just go. <laughs> it's been fun. Don't come back. <laughs>